of another mass shooting brings attention to the safety measures to keep our kids safe in our schools. Some local Valley districts are now taking the initiative to work together and continue that conversation. Ellen E. Dow shows us how. Several school districts across the valley have multiple buildings in multiple cities, so those districts came together with city police departments like City of Buckeye, Goodyear, and over there, there's Avondale. Now, these groups came together to make sure that their school safety plans are uniform just in case of an emergency. During the initial phase of lockdown, we asked the students to turn their phones off. Maintain silence, correct? Some tough conversations to keep students safe. Safety of our students, um, the safe and friendly environment of our schools, that is the number one priority. That is what we think about day in and day out. That's what we lose sleep over. Many lost sleep over the tragic Uvalde school shooting. That's why three West Valley school districts came together to create this summit, to make sure they can work together in their different cities with several police and fire departments and keep kids and staff safe. We can't plan for every incident that could be out there, but there's a lot of things that we can do before an incident happens that would make us more successful in handling any incidents that do come our way. They discussed how to help students in times of crisis, what will be done in case of an emergency, and they learned that some of the simplest safety protocols could go a long way. The simplicity of locking a door. I think that is something that's so powerful that a lot of times we think of safety and we think of a dollar value and that it's going to be extremely expensive. This year is the first for these West Valley agencies to come together. They hope to bring it back again to continue the important conversations of keeping kids safe. There is no higher priority than safety. Uh, before we even worry about academics, uh, students need to feel safe, staff needs to feel safe, and our parents need to feel safe sending their kids to our schools. In Buckeye, Eleni Dow, ABC 15, Arizona. Well, tomorrow